eliminate it. Well, guess what's going to happen? People still abuse their spouse where they don't pay by price. You never really address the real problem. And we do this a lot with many of these other topics. Yes. What you are doing to me too, as a woman? You are a human being. Yes. And the problem again is, even as a woman, in my father's house, when I talk, I am my father's child. As soon as they transfer that right, that man takes over. My family, in a way, not in many, in many ways, in a way, they if I should belong to their, they should just, I mean, it takes two people to create children. Your father didn't create the children with you, so why should they have your father's name? But you're talking about biologically speaking. Again, there's so many aspects to what makes us humans and not just random animals, right? If it was just biology, we'd just be another animal out on the streets. We won't be able to create technology. We won't be able to create lifestyle by design, having options, emotions, socialization is a big part of it right so of course as human beings we've created institutions part of that institution is you know like tribal religious marriage right judicial like we create a structure for society because we're humans and part of that is like you know we assigned a different type of meaning to those children when the bride price was not paid this, uh, this, this were the ways that societies either became societies, they conquered other societies or territories and territories were taken over by kings and warriors of the past. These are the things that makes us humans. So we don't get to get stuck on biology or technicalities. That's not how this shit works. <laughs> I'm sorry. I wish it was different, but it's not how it works. <laughs> Whether you pay bright price or not, I don't believe I don't agree with that aspect of culture, but I respect it. That's what I mean. Right. And you can disagree with it, but back in the days, there are ways that you disagree with stuff like that, and they would tell, they will order the soldiers to go bond to you and that guy into, and they will put, they will lock him up forever, and then you come back to the household, or they will take all your children and take them into slavery. I mean, there's so many things that you know civilization has helped us improve on, but again, I don't think it's uh, all the way accurate to say, hey biologically technically like who owns the baby owns the baby that's not how society works if it was uh we wouldn't be humans right so if the children it's uh, if he said that the children belongs to my father mm -hmm. and my father and everything that i own belongs to my father because i am still my father's child Right. Till my father grants me over to a new person and yeah. that person takes over the world. And that's no matter how old you get. Sorry. Right. I understand it. If now. I have okay. houses, if I have anything, if anything I have belongs to my father. But as soon as he transfers that right to the man, even if he collects five naira, ten So once bride price is paid, you become the man's property. Okay. Now it's supposed to be just a customary thing to do but again someone is abusing it right naira 20 naira 100 naira from that man even if i own mansions automatically they have transferred all of me to him you see good luck that's a problem for me because you see we are talking about equality and you see that the, the culture you see, when there's a lot going on in Africa in terms of relationship and marriages, and we talk about abuse here mm. every day, how, can you, the way you've analyzed it now, I know you are talking about the culture, how it is in your hometown in Anambra State, but can you just see from your simple explanation how no, you are being no. transferred from your father to your husband? So, yes, when, that's what when I'm do saying. you become your own person as a woman? I am saying that in my culture that's why i don't like the bride price practice yeah i know i know i, I know what you're saying but i'm just trying because... to bring that out sorry yeah i know i know you don't agree with it but i'm saying that this is also very unfair to women so yes, that, the culture that... is basically saying that as a woman you are, you are not nothing very... and these are sizable books they are minimum 200 pages uh, you can download them absolutely for free uh, by simply going to, for example, this one, you just go to getmymarriage.com, smartrealestatewholesaling.com, uh, realestatemoneysecrets.com. So yes, I am a three times author. Those books are out there for your for your consumption, and they are also available everywhere on Amazon, anywhere that you pick up books. So in case you prefer a physical book like that. But you are nobody. Is that yes. you belong to your father? 
or you belong to a husband. Yeah. So is it making sense why there's serious problems right now, right? Uh, especially men, we're responsible for this. Okay, okay. We it's, it's basically men that want to fight to not abolish this type of tradition. It's basically men that's doing that fight. Is men that will sit as king's men or next to the king of any society and then try to fight against this kind of uh, re rebellious fight against you know tradition and stuff like that. But then we're supposed to maintain the integrity of the system right no one should be taking the idea of bright price to as a way to manipulate or abuse their spouse but men are doing that right so we create these institutions and culture and customs and tradition but we don't we don't maintain the integrity of it right i think the integrity has been compromised once you once you have one of us go out there and say i paid your bright price so i'm gonna beat you up if you say things like that or you say anything like that you know sometimes we banter we say uh you know i banter like that before like hey i paid the bride price and my wife based on the story i told you earlier would say no it was given back right but actually you were not supposed to know that it was given back like that right um the family would know right but you pay the bride price you pay even if it was given back it was still paid right traditionally speaking right that means you actually brought the right you did the rights and you did the rituals and all that kind of stuff but the point that i'm making here is this the idea that we allow we are allowing such a beautiful thing by itself to we allow the integrity of it to be compromised by bad behavior by bad behavior such as abusing the spouse then you have women again anything you give women they'll multiply then you give them the audacity or the right, actually not audacity, the actual right to say, you know what? This bride price of a thing is making people start to attach a, a dollar price to the value of women. And this is why they think they can manipulate or maltreat women, right? So they have a point. I still don't think it needs to be abolished. I think the problem is just bad people, right? And I think the onus is still on us as men to call this kind of people to order and say, you don't have the right to say, to bring up the bride price when you are actively abusing your wife. Then you give her the automatic right to say, you know what? We're returning the bride price. That's not what you wanted. What you wanted was to build a family right these are the real issues the real issue is not the bride price the real issue is the person who was basically manipulating the, the idea of a bride price as a as a as a weapon okay against their own partner and we basically ignore the actual conversation only to try to drag bride price and uh, sorry drag bride price and, and eliminate it well guess what's gonna happen People still abuse their spouse where they don't pay bride price. You never really address the real problem. And we do this a lot with many of these other topics. Yes. But you are and the individual as a woman, you are a human being. Yes. And the problem again is, even as a woman, in my father's house, when I talk, I am my father's child. As soon as they transfer that right, that man takes over. My family, in a way, not in many ways, in a way, they 